Welcome back to more two gay guys play. Opening a door. Yep. Yeah. Look at that. Oh, here we Cut go. Scene. Cut scenes. This is what you came bow, here for, bow, people. Bow, bow, bow. Bow. Oh, hey, Tesla. Are you dead now? Are you never going to go to America and get fucked over by Thomas Edison? Does this mean that now we're the Avengers? Uh, we're going to go. I don't know. I, I think he's my... Uh, shit, what's his name? Q? Oh. In the Bond movies? Yeah. He's still in there. He seems to be okay. We made it. Okay, he's just a little bruised. It's too late. There's nothing we can do. Still you just stay there, still. you Serbian bastard. Something I can do because I've got magic water. Yeah. Oh, and we're in and we're in sixteen. I just assume he's racist to everybody that isn't British. <laughs> and though you have to be the right kind of British. Right. From a certain part of London. Yeah. Like one Master! district. Oh, what's gonna happen? I like that gun. That was yeah. That that set of families designing that. <laughs> it's true. I mean, complex and like really good models sell a lot of things. There's one guy in my um, one of my 3D classes that made the most incredible motorcycle, and our our teacher was like. That's that's sexy. You will get a job with that. <laughs> like not even lying. And this is the guy, the teacher being the guy who is like lead dire um, like animation director and animator on Roly Polioli. <laughs> so. Oh no! He took our great gun, man, and then threw it to the ground. And now he's gonna use a knife instead. Okay. All right, dude. Really gonna have a knife? <laughs> Are we really gonna have a knife fight when we have lightning guns? God, I hate this game so much. <laughs> no, there is a light. There is we'll a, have a shaving competition. Ugh, I'm going to shave your mustache. No, I can't come without it. <laughs> I think you had options. Yeah, that. I assume if I hit too many wrong options, I die. But you know that's fine. Yeah, because that's how a, a knife fight would go. Yeah, this is very much. This is much more like heavy rain to me. Uh, I know nothing, and I don't want to know, because now there's a PS4 version, so I can play it. I don't mean, like, in plot. I mean just, like, how okay. the chemicals work. Like, I really like Indigo Prophecy, or Fahrenheit. Right. Uh, and now I'm a werewolf. Uh, that's L2 for quick attacks, R2 for strong attacks. Oh, boy. I'm really bad at these. Because suddenly the quick time events use, like every button on the fucking controller. Yep. And they're like, oh, you better hit this button you never have to use to move. Yeah. Oh, and... Gotta be ready with that right stick, man. Yeah. Apparently. I assume I'm doing something right. I mean, you're surviving. Well, yeah, fuck that lab. I mean, if, I if hate you're science. Not, if you're not breaking glass, I mean, there's really no way to know if you're, uh... L1 for a series of attacks. Oh, I hate All right. Something. Actually, no, I didn't. Man. You, Jesus Christ. The problem is, I don't naturally leave my, like, finger on the right stick. Oh. I have it on the X button, so, like, this is, like, very different than how I normally, like, play video games. When I realize shooters, you need to always, like, be on the right button. Yeah. I mean, on, on the, like, right stick. But, like, I'm just not used to it. Okay, it didn't hit it fast enough. Fine. Whatever. At least we're not dead. It's not a one fuck up, you're dead. Now we do the whole cutscene 14 times. I mean, they might have us do this, like, section over in a loop. Yeah, like, as long as there's fucking checkpoints, I really don't mind it. Oh. I assume he's telegraphing and I'm just not fucking paying attention. Which, that's fine. Oh. Oh. Yeah, I think you're right. I think there's just like section. Oh, yep, yeah, that's what I wanted to do. Yeah, thank you. Fucking shit him, man. Yeah, like this is prison and you're my bitch. Oh, hey, you don't look like you're in super great condition. Um, neither am I. Where's my magic 5 0 water? Thing? It's underneath your under armor. Uh. Stab him. Stab, Stab him. him. Stab him with I'm a knife. I'm pressing this as fast as I can. Yeah. Oh. Mm. Like, mm. I, I've also done that, like, ten times. Oh, he's changing back, which means it worked. Yep, yep. That's how we know. That's how you know. <laughs> this... 
the fucking credits of this game are going to be... Uh, that's never happened before, but fine. The credits of this game are going to be like 15 minutes. I've like, too long to yeah. not know this day would come. Why, oh, Alistair? Like, I'm wondering, is this the end, or is there just going to be another bigger boss? I think this is the last chapter. Well, I know it's the last chapter, but is that going to be the last fight, which is kind of cool. Yeah, I mean, I assume, because this is a bad game, we've had our big climactic fight, and we have an anticlimactic fight right after that insults your intelligence. Uh, so I assume we have to go to his uh, dad and press X to stab. In the name of the God. Well, from the things that I've heard, it, they felt like people who play this like, I got to the end, and I'm like, oh, I thought this is the end of, like, the prologue. So it was just kind of like a... It just went out with a whimper. So if it was just a QTE fight, which was admittedly cool-looking. Yeah. Your father. Like, that's my review of this game. Uh, admittedly cool-looking. Yeah. Like, man, this game looks cool as shit. I hope you pass this uh, engine around to people. Yeah, I hope that, like, you get to make the sequel that this is obviously setting up. Yeah. I've lived with. My son. Oh, there he is. Father. Forgive me. Oh, no. It is I <laughs> who needs your forgiveness. I never meant this life for you. Oh, are we having a change of heart? I have always known. That you were gay. <laughs> I rescued him from the massacre of his family. I, uh, when you were a wee wolf pup. You were adorable. I mean, how could I resist you? You were playfully gnawing on everything. <laughs> oh, so, so murdering is fine. Murdering a child. How could I? <laughs> yeah, how could I take the life of an innocent? Like all of those poor people I've been murdering this whole game. Murder. Yeah. Well, I mean, they weren't innocent. They were poor. <laughs> right. They were guilty of that. This gospel of prosperity. The revelation would shake our order to its very foundations. Okay. Yeah. So. So I am to be sacrificed. How many more must die to ensure an eternal silence? I mean, just one. He is my son. And he's gay. And a werewolf. <laughs> be the and I'll have none of it. Life. As long as I give you the gun and don't shoot it myself, I still get into heaven, is what I'm saying. <laughs> I won't feel bad Joe. about this. Yeah. And the council must never discover the truth, lest all you hold dear perish. Now shoot him. I mean, I assume that's what's going to happen. Right. I will be given a QTE sequence and I can choose. And then the next game, it's Batman and Robin, and he's Batman and the werewolf is Robin. (laughs) He's in a little mask and it's adorable. I'm okay with tiny werewolf Robin. And by tiny, I mean like full grown man. But still. United. Like, I don't know if you ever read the manga Crescent Moon. Nope. But one of the main characters is the werewolf who's like this cute Japanese guy who's like 20, has like like piercings all in his ears and his lip and his nose. Mm-hmm. When he turns into a werewolf, they're still there. Huh. So he's just like a, a cool like rock star who turns into like a white werewolf with all these piercings. Huh. That's all I want. Well, I think we could have shot and just walked away. Yep. So. Well, guess I gotta get to the murder boner. Maybe then we shall know true peace. <sighs> okay. Emotions. Emotions. Emotions and lens flares. Oh, fine. I will click the button to continue the cutscene. I really should be regenerating this blood away at this point. <laughs> yeah. Should be sucking back into your body. Like, if, I, if it's oh. not a trigger button, I'm going to be upset. If it's like square. It's not, it's not going to be a trigger button. It never... Oh, it is the trigger button. All right. It's the first time it's actually been the trigger button. Yeah. So, am I... Oh. Yeah. That's the game. Okay. Burn the forest down. Right. <laughs> oh. Yeah, that was that. Okay. So, hey, we did that in the span of a regular episode. Uh, okay. How do you feel? Do you feel a giant sense of accomplishment? Do you feel like you've experienced something you could never experience anywhere else? Yes, but I also feel tired. Yeah? I feel like this game was lovingly crafted, and they spent so much on chairs, they <laughs> couldn't make a game. Yeah, but you know what? It was pretty looking, and <sighs> I I crapped on the brown and the dankness of everything. Mm-hmm. But I kind I like the aesthetic. Oh yeah, like, and that's what this game is, in aesthetic. Like, yeah, it feels true. like this game was, like, 
somebody and their friends uh, built their OC, uh, <laughs> all, all their like OC cosplay troop that mm -hmm. are all like Van Helsing characters. Yeah, and then built the elaborate mythology around them because they're all like fifteen year olds on on Tumblr or for forums or whatever. Yeah, I don't know where people RP now. Yeah, that's all I'm saying. Me neither. Uh, and like, then somehow someone gave them a hundred million dollars. Like, I feel if. Uh... You know, we had a bunch of people on the cover of the game, mm -hmm. and there those people were in this game, but I expected them all, since they're all on a team, to be playable. Like, if this game was more in the gameplay department of, say, something like Borderlands, where it's oh, like yeah. you and a bunch of people going pick, out and doing this. Pick a class. This one's better at werewolf killing. This one's yep. better at vampire killing. Right. Or if it's something like Modern Warfare, where you're swapping between characters. Mm -hmm. Like, in the first one, you're swapping between, like, uh, British uh, special ops and, like, American ground soldiers. Mm -hmm. So they're very different kinds of missions, and you're playing a different person. Yeah. Uh, that'd be fine. Yeah. But when I'm just playing Shouty McGee and his terrible mustache. I feel, also, besides the werewolves and the crazy Tesla guns that they tried too much to be rooted in realism, which I think kind of, like, killed it. Like, just embrace the fantasy. Be like, this is really cool and really weird and not like the 1886 time at all, you know? Yeah, like, uh, there's a there's a movie that's also set in, like, the 1890s called, uh, uh Adele Blancsac. It's a French adventure movie. But, uh, it involves her, like, riding dinosaurs. And, and like, we're talking about Adele, the singer, right? Yes. Okay, uh, gotcha. And, like, just going on an adventure and solving a mystery with that dinosaurs are around, because yeah. why not? Why wouldn't you? Of course. So, like, it was just that. Like, with this game. And I realize these credits are boring to look at, because nobody thought to get those art directors in on this <laughs> section. Uh, this is just sad. I'm going to wait for a saving checkpoint halfway through, so in case you missed it. I'm going to wait for, like, a post-credit scene setting up that, like, what the plot of the next game is. Because this whole game isn't a fucking sequel tease. I don't know what is. Uh, it's like the... the focus pullers? What yeah. are those? I don't know. And they're the people who, like, uh, jerk off everybody else while they're coding. <laughs> don't be thinking about, you know, other things. Just... just Focus. Relieve the stress and focus. And we're going to pull on your dicks. We need to clone more programmers. <laughs> uh, like, I haven't seen this, like... If there is not a scene, I'm going to be irritated. If there is a scene, then I'm going to have a joke. Oh, but well, like, hopefully we get to see something like that then, because that's what we need around here. Jokes. Ah, uh, just Jesus. Oh, okay. Oh. We have a logo. That might have been uh, a quicker... All right, uh, I assume that's ready, ready at Don's logo. Yes. Oh, now the game crashed? Oh, nope. save. Oh, oh, boy. The whole of London is looking I'm for sure you. that's true. We mustn't delay. A night no more. Oh, boy. What, what are we going to be? Sir Galahad, can you hear me? Am I Batman? The 21st day of December. Sir Galahad. London under martial law. Be at ease, Nicola. All is fine. Oh, good. Nikolai is still fine. So you say, my friend. Open up your cloak the and float down there and punch some people. There is no telling when the authorities will decide to mount an offensive. I mean, this is a shot now from fucking Arkham, Ar Arkham City. Yeah. I like, I've seen this shot in those games. Mm -hmm. Advise we follow the lady's lead and leave the city. I'll join you shortly. All right, he's got to go enact some vengeance. And don't yep. you know? Don't you know? Galahad. Galahad no more. <gasps> My real Takes name. off his cosplay patch. My real name is Mad Max. Man, that is just the most blatant sequel tease since, like, the mid-credits of Green Lantern. <laughs> right. Well, like, it was... it. I watched that movie, which I like. Mm. Uh, and it's bad. Like, yeah. it is terrible. But I watched it, and I saw that sequel tease, and I'm like, you are not getting a sequel. Yeah, no. That movie bombed hard. It almost destroyed Ryan Reynolds' career. Like, Luckily. and he is he is attractive enough that he can survive bad movies, and then almost de destroyed his career. Yeah, uh, and like, there there's just a sequel tease of oh, we're gonna do something else. No, you're not. Yeah, <laughs> like, and that never happened. Yeah. Well, I will say this: after that scene, and for most of this game, if they could take the criticisms levied against the game from everybody and make a sequel that's better and more robust. Like if I, can, I look forward to it. 
Oh yeah, like if I could get the Order 1887, sorry about the first one. Yeah. That's the subtitle? Yeah. On the box? Yeah. Like, then I'm good with that. Well, do you want to, do you want to call this? We're done here and we can play uh, more games next time? Like, I w yeah, because I, I don't know, like, how long these credits are going to be. Right. I feel like they're already too long. <laughs> like, I understand it took too many people to yeah. make this game. Very fair. Uh, and I'm just like, I just want to shower beer. Well, let's do that then. Okay. Well, then we'll be done here and we'll play another different game. I'm also curious if there's another scene at the end of the credits. And there's I, not. I think that's you, the end. You think so? Yeah, I do. The sequel tease? Yep. All right. Then uh, we'll play something else next time here on Two Gay Guys Play. Yeah, we don't know what we're going to play, but there will be another game after this, we swear. Yep. Bye. Bye.